In the previous video we showed you how to create these uh, seven buttons that fall under the soft drinks submenu or soft drinks category. Uh, we're going to continue that right now by creating some more buttons and showing you how it all looks like when there's more buttons than can be shown on one screen. So we'll go ahead and create more buttons. They will also fall under the soft drinks submenu or category because that's the only one we have uh, still and then later on we'll create another submenu button. So we'll see how that goes. And in case you're wondering where the buttons that we're creating, they're uh, also in here, they cannot be shown uh, more than seven buttons, just like on the main sales screen. We kept it like that so you get the idea of what it can be shown on the sales screen at once. So you click the forward button and you get to see the eighth, ninth, tenth, and eleventh button that we just created. Back button takes you back to a previous page. And now you get the idea of how this works. Same on the main screen, forward button, back button. Now let's go ahead and create that extra submenu button. We do that by clicking the add, add submenu button in here. And uh, let's name this one alcohol. Now, in order to add buttons that belong to it, we have to select the proper submenu, let's select alcohol. So that's our alcohol submenu and going back to the soft drink submenu. On the main screen, same concept. You select the submenu, shows you the buttons for that submenu. You can go back, forth, and if we had more submenus in here, same back and forth uh, buttons. That's that regarding quick menu buttons.